Welcome to the Lord's Table Church. Um, I invite you now, if you need to pause this video, to gather some elements for your meal. It, they don't have to be perfect. Jesus was using the elements of a Passover meal. He was using what was there and giving it new meaning. So I have been able to find a bagel and some apple juice. <laughs> and that will be my communion meal. You gather what you have and I'll meet you back here. And once you're gathered, um, join with those in your home and just find that comfortable place and come to the Lord's table. He sets it for you and he invites you to it. And we remember that Jesus knew what it was like to be surrounded by enemies. Enemies who meant him harm, enemies who um, tortured him, murdered him. And he set a table for his followers, he gave them this meal so that they would remember him, his power, and remember that they weren't alone. He, hadn't, he hasn't left us alone. And so we remember that on his last night here with us, he took bread and he broke it and he gave it to his disciples and he said, eat this all of you. This is my body broken for you. And then our Lord took the cup and again, he thanked God and he said, this is my blood of a new covenant poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Whenever you do this, remember me. And so right now I'd like to pray a blessing, not just over this bread and this juice, but over the elements that you have in your home. So would you pray with me? God, I pray that you would pour out your Holy Spirit over all of us who gather together digitally, but we are your body. We unite our spirits, Lord. I pray that you would pour out your Holy Spirit over not just this bread and this juice, but over all the elements in all the homes and all the times and the places where people are celebrating this meal. That though we may be separated by time and by distance, your Holy Spirit would be with all of us, uniting us and making this into one table. I pray, Lord, that your Spirit would be poured out in us as we partake this meal, that we could be messengers of redemption and hope in a world that is very trying and dark right now, that we could be bringers of the good news just like the apostles of old. Go with us, lead the way, and show us where to step, and we will be faithful to be there. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So as you take the bread, you can share it with each other with the words, this is the body of Christ broken for you. And whatever drink you have, you can share it with each other with the words, this is the blood of Christ shed for you. Though we are far apart by distance, we have been brought together through this table. And I have enjoyed sharing this meal with you, my church. I'm looking forward to the day when we can eat it again together in person. But until then, I'm trusting the Holy Spirit to be uniting us. And um, just always know that at this table, you are welcome because Christ has opened it to all.